Hello everyone and welcome to part two. That's right, part two of my John Wayne collection. Alright, let's do this. Let's see what we've got. And I'm gonna show you it. So we've got 12 titles here. 12, 13 titles. So let's check out what we have in this collection. So where did we carry off from? So the last thing we carried off from was on number six. So this is seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Yeah, eighteen, nineteen. Well, I think it's nineteen. Anyway, let's check a look. Let's have a look. <laughs> Today we'll be taking a look at my part two of John Wayne. So let's take a look. So what's with the first one? Oh yes, the films. So I've got some films here. Now I'm not going to show you them, all of them, but I will show you them in a minute. You know, in order, in, in date order. So here is my titles, my film titles. So I've got two box sets and a few titles here. So what I'm going to do, yeah, this is what I'm going to do. I'm not going to do it by order now. I'm just going to do it to show you my collection. Because, you know, I haven't got all of his films. You know, not all of them. But I, I will show you half of them. So, let's carry off from number seven. So, let's start with these films. Uh, so, let's start with the first one. So, let's start with the first one. This is number seven. And this movie is called... And these are all in date order, I think. This is the film called Without Reservations. This is a very rare DVD. This is a John Wayne movie. So here is the front. And I'll show you the back. Really awesome art, uh, you know, pictures on there. And, you know, tells you the stuff there on the back. You know, it tells you information about the movie. So this this DVD came out by Sim Simply Home Entertainment. There, I've got my words up there. This is a region free DVD. So is the DVD in there? Yes, it is. So you got artwork as well. So here is the artwork inside the DVD. So this is what the DVD looks like. And this DVD is absolutely scratched. I don't know how I'm going to, you know, re-get this again. Because it's scratched to pieces. And hopefully if I play it, it'll work. If it don't, I'll just re-exchange the DVDs. Here is the, uh, you know, the DVD uh, there. And there's the artwork. And there's the background showing you more information about other films that's coming out. By this company so yeah that is without reservations there there we go with this uh, it looks really scratched so I might we exchange it to you so that's number one so that's came out in 1940s this came out in the 1940s I put it in the text down below when this film came out it's a 1940s movie there so here is another 1940s film. This is a limited edition Blu-ray. This is made by the Premium Collection. This is a film that came out in 2020. So not you know, a film that came out. This is a Blu-ray DVD Blu-ray release that came out in 2020. So I'm going to look down and show you what I've got. And this is number eight. So this is number eight. And what is number eight? Well, number eight is. That's right, this is it. This is the premium movie, premium collection, HMV exclusive for the movie They Were Expendable. This movie is also stars Robert Montgomery and Donna Reed and Ward Bond. Now, I have got to mention this film is a John Ford movie uh, production, and obviously John Ford worked a lot with John Wayne. So let's take a look. This is the front. Really nice artwork there. You get John Wayne there and all the other cast. Uh, I think that's Robert Montgomery and there's the boat there. And here is the back. Now, obviously, you get some awesome... The only bonus feature you get in this is a theatrical trailer, which is very annoying, but it doesn't matter. So you get stills from the movie, pictures, and, you know, this is a 2020 release. So, yeah. And if you open it, it comes with a really nice slip. So it slips off very easily. Very, uh slimsy but plastic it's really hard study it's plastic it's really nice it's really good so there is the plastic case for the blu-ray there of their expendable and here is the blu-ray now as you can see the cast at the bottom here is a bit big so i don't think you had that on the slip 
So there, here it is, the um, Blu-ray. So this is what the Blu-ray looks like. And if you open it, you get just the standalone Blu-ray. You don't get any other, you know, you don't get a DVD, you just get a Blu-ray. So let's take a look, you know, on my iPad. So this is a limited edition. So this set obviously contains art cards. Now I have showed you the back, the front, so there we go, the same with the nice slip here. So, they were expendable. Very good film. Navy film, I think. This is set in the Navy. Uh, this is set in the Navy, isn't it? What? Pacific. Yeah, anyway, it's really good. Um, that slip. Here is the Blu-ray. I'll show you the Blu-ray first. So here is the Blu-ray. It looks good, fresh, looks you know, new. And I'll take these goodies out so I can show you that later. And I'll show you this, this artwork here. So, as you can see, I'll take this out because then you'll get a good view. So, here is what the artwork looks like. So, the artwork looks like this. Just get, like, really um nice-looking background there. I think this is the making of the movie. Now, this is one of the scenes from the movie where the car is going through and, you know, bad weather there or something. Really awesome artwork there, really awesome background. That's what you get for this release. So yeah, fantastic 2020 release. I have got to say, I love this edition for this film. I haven't got the DVD version. I don't like rebuying things um, usually. But yeah, that is the Blu-ray there. So let's get into the goodies. Now, you do get this, I've got to say. So you get the what's coming out by Premium Collection and all the titles that premium has made over the years premium collection over the years but over the you know anyway put that advert in there and let's take at the goodies so the first thing you get in this edition is a lovely awesome poster let's take a look so in this collection let's take this poster out it's gonna be this is gonna be a long video but it's worth it so here it is here's the poster now this must be the theatrical poster from the movie they were expendable there we go. So uh, besides cowboy movies that John Wayne has appeared in, he has made uh, the, um, what's it, the, uh, you know, he made Western, he made Western movies, obviously, but he also made Navy movies, so like set in the Navy and, uh, you know, like army kind of films. But here is one of them here, Navy film, Navy army film, I should say. Fantastic, phenomenal poster there. I love that. Yep, smell brand new. I know I'm weird. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But that that's there. So there's the poster there for the they were expendable. Let's take this out. Put this in. There we go. So that's one thing you do get with this Blu-ray. And also you get some art cards. So you get lovely art cards from this movie. And um, so yeah, let's take a look. So here is the first one. So here's the first art card, really nice art card there. This must be the printing from the main cover. So here is other art cards. So here is one of them. Here's one. And here is the next one, picture of John Wayne. There we go. And the last card no, I think this is the last card, isn't it? Yeah, the last card, which is uh, this one. There we go. That's all the art cards there. Fantastic. I love it. Really good. So there we go. Okay. There we go. Take that out and take the art cards in. So there that is there were expendable uh edition there. Let's take this all in. Don't I lose it? There we go. So there it is. They were expendable. The premium edition for they were expendable there on Blu-ray. So yeah, it looks phenomenal, looks great on Blu-ray. Uh there we go. So that is my eighth one. So let's take a look on my I did check the DVD release for this one. And, by the way, if you want to know something, no, it doesn't have a trailer. It says there, original technical trailer, 
when I plugged it on, there was no trailer there. So it, it was this DVD is lying. MGM DVD is lying. So that's not really good. I, I wasn't expecting that. I thought they was going to put the trailer on there, but they didn't, which is very upsetting. But you get the movie. It looks phenomenal. It looks great. So here is the DVD there. So yeah, and this is region two. There is the artwork there. You do got artwork here. Now, I might get the Blu-ray. I don't know. I don't know. For now, I'm sticking with the DVD. So here it is. Um, Wed River. Said it had a trailer, but it didn't. So there it is, the Red River there. So that's the ninth one. So let's take a look at the next one. So, what's the next one? Why, this one I did show you before. This is So this is the 1950s now, so this is 1951. Now this film I did show you on my uh, uh, mail, my po uh, package unboxing, when I was unboxing my stuff that I got from eBay and Amazon. So this is one of them I picked up. So this is Operation Pacific. Now I did mention this before in my um, other video. This is a fantastic film, and I'm going to unbox it for you, show you what it's like. So here is the front of the film. Really good. Here is the back. Nice artwork there, nice stills from the movie. Let me give they get a good pause and read that. So if you open this, it also gives you this little leaflet here. This little leaflet. So I remember having these years, years back, uh, 13 years ago. Not 13 years ago. Yeah, 13 years ago and a couple more. Not a couple more, but um, a year after I did see these as well. Because I still collected DVDs and not Blu-rays. Here we go. So here is the... Um, I obviously collect Blu-rays more now than I did back then. So here's Operation Pacific. So here's the DVD of that movie. And it looks good. It looks good. It's DVD. Look. So there we go. I ordered this and it was £2. So I got it. And it looked good. It looked like one of these rare John Wayne films anyway. So I picked it up. Operation Pacific 1951. So here we got a triple feature collection, John Wayne collection. And this is based on uh, Warner Brothers. So Warner Brothers have released this uh, edition here. This is a Region 2 DVD and this is the John, the John Wayne collection. And this is what the front looks like. Get a nice picture of John Wayne there. Yeah, very cool. And you get a cast of what the movie is. So you get the cast in each movie, you know, telling you what each movie is. Four movies here. So let's take a look. Here's what the DVD set looks like. Here's the cast of movies there. So this is a set distributed by Warner Brothers. So here's what you get. You only get disc one of the movie for the searches. But I don't care because they got the stuff here and they got the trailer on this d edition DVD here. So I'm not bothered. You know, it's kind of annoying that it does say disc one. It's very triggering. Triggering. So that's 1956, The Searches, on DVD. Looks great. And the next one, we have a classic movie, 1959's Rio Bravo on DVD. It looks great on DVD. I love this film. Uh, but yeah, look how many finger marks is on it. And I recently had this. Well, not recently but the back looks great it doesn't have no scratches or anything as you can see all fresh and new so that's rio bravo there a fantastic film uh i don't know if this has a blu-ray release tell me in the comments down below if some of these films have blu-ray releases but yeah it's rio bravo um and tell me what your favorite and tell me what your favorite john wayne film is as well rio bravo there on dvd with dean martin and chisholm we've got chisholm here 1968 i believe no 1970 yeah 1970 and that's a good film, that is. Uh, 1970, as Chisholm. And the last film we have in this collection is Cajal's United States Marshal on here. And this is a 1973 film. So that looks really good. Really awesome artwork for all of these discs. Uh, except for the one that doesn't have the disc, but doesn't have artwork, but it doesn't matter. So there it is, all the movies here in this collection. And this is a set that came out in 2000 and... No, 2021! This DVD release. Wow. So a recent one then. So that there was number 11. This one here. So let's take a look at number 12. And what is number 12? Wow. Number 12 is a movie. 
here. So this is the movie here what I picked up. And this is a 1956 movie. No, wrong. 1966. Sorry. And this is a movie that stars the great. Well, all of these are the great, obviously. But we got Kirk Douglas. Kirk Douglas. There we go. Kirk Douglas. Uh, great legend. Awesome actor. Absolute legend. And... He, he has a son called Michael Douglas, which is also an awesome legendary actor as well. So, yeah, uh, Kirk Douglas. So here is the front. This movie is called Cast a Giant Shadow. Now, this is a John Wayne movie. John Wayne plays the sergeant in this film, the main sergeant. So um, I did class this as a John Wayne film, but Kirk Douglas is one of the main lead actors. And plus, Kirk Douglas has been actually in a few John Wayne films, actually three, three. So he was in this film, Cast cast a, a giant shadow it was also in the war wagon which i will show you in a minute my further one and he was also in the movie this the uh, the other movie which is the um i have it here in harm's way in harm's way so so anyway i'm jabbering on so yeah legendary actors so on the front here it's cast a giant shadow this is an mgm movie and the main star is Kirk douglas we get John Wayne, obviously, and Frank Sinatra, the singer, is in this film, and Yul Brenner from The Magnificent Seven. So, yeah, fantastic, um, fantastic cast in this film. So here's the front. Here is the back. You do get some artwork there. Really cool. And if you open it, the DVD is inside. There we go, so you've got Blue C DVD. And the DVD looks great, it doesn't have no scratches or anything. So that's really good. Really cool. And that was 1966. Cast a giant shadow. And that was number 12. Now, the next film. This film really shocked me. This is a fantastic Western film. I've only seen clips of this. I've never seen it full on, so I will re-watch this film when I, you know, reach my John Wayne collection. But this film is actually really, really, really good. I think you just seen it a bit. But this film is a 1962 film, so I done it in a completely wrong way. I should have done 19. I should have done this before that cast the giant shadow, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, just a phenomenal film. Absolutely phenomenal. So. I'm going to name you the cast in this fantastic Western film. So we have Henry Fonda, Gregory Peck, Caroline Jones, George Peppard. I, I wouldn't read a few of them, but there is a few notable. Debbie Reynolds, James Stewart, Ellie Welch, Richard Widmark, um, Walter Brennan. Is in this film as well. Mickey Shaunsey, uh, Henry Morgan, and Russ Tamblin. But we have famous actors here, it's unbelievable. But this film is How the West Was Won on Blu ray. So I got this How the West Was Won on Blu ray. This is the Blu ray release here. So this is a release that came out in 2008. This has two discs. Uh, this is a 1962 film, like I just said earlier. So, look, so here's the front. A phenomenal film. How the West was won. They filmed it in two, um, two ways. They cinema it. They cinema it. They showed you it in the cinema uh, edition. So I'll, I'll just explain to you. So here is the front. Lovely front, by the way. Really awesome. Artwork. Here is the back. So you got all the cast for movies. You want to pause it and recognize all the cast there. Phenomenal, legendary cast here. So in this Blu-ray disc set, you get two discs. You get the first disc, which is the which is the widescreen letterbox version. So you get the widescreen widescreen version on disc one. Obviously, you get bonus features on disc two, and you get the presentation on disc two. But disc two has mainly all the special features. So here's disc one, widescreen version, and here's disc two. Now disc two is the curved screen smile box silhouette edition here on disc two 
So, the second disc for this film, How the West Was Won. There's, ha there's a second disc, and the second disc is the presentation of how this film was actually seen in the cinema and oh my god it's absolutely shocking how it was filmed i love the widescreen version but you have an option to choose from the widescreen version and the other version oh sorry i'm here no it's not so you get a scene where that's like uh like i'll show a picture of it here so you can get a demonstration of how it would look like and everything so yeah that's how the, this is how the west was won a phenomenal long film how the West was won. Fantastic. I'm glad I have this. They did They did it very differently, the movies. This film had a very different uh, making of... Because they directed it very... The camera angles for that film was very different how they represented it in. Like, camera-wise. Like, when they angled it and everything. So, yeah, very good film. So, let's check out the next one. So, that was number 13. So, check out on the other one. So this is number 14, and with our next one, which is a movie which I've never heard of before. I've never hardly, I've never seen this before. Some of these films I've never actually seen before. This is a 1957 film. So it ran from 196, 19, when was it? 19, 19, from 1962 to 1957. Wow. Different, different dates. Anyway. This movie is called A Legend of the Lost. I've never heard this film ever. This stars Sophia Lorraine and Rosiana Brazil. Uh, yeah, sorry if I can't say the name right. But yeah, here is the DVD. This has been put out by MGM Entertainment. MGM. Legend of the Lost here. It's a thin DVD. It's a very thin DVD. Very unusual. But a very good film. It looks a good film. Here's the back there. The artwork. Yeah. Really cool. And the DVD is here with a, a black disc saying Legend of the Lost with white writing on it there. Very cool. So that is the the 13th one, I think. No, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14th one. So check out the another, another one. And this one is the... Ooh. And with this one, this is the Hall Soldiers. We've got two more titles of movies here. And then we go to the two box sets. Right, so this is the Horse Soldiers. Very interesting. Never heard of this one before. Really nice artwork there. So this also stars William Holden. Interesting. Here is the back. Really nice. You've got scenes from the movie as well. So that looks good. You also have artwork as well. So here is the DVD. Very nice artwork. And here you have the artwork inside the disc you get a horseshoe inside the disc insert artwork there and you get pictures there really cool and you get the cast of the movie and you get the scene selections of the movie so wow that's pretty cool that is really awesome actually so yeah never seen this film i can't wait to give this film a go that is horse soldiers very interesting that's number 15 i think i don't know well, one, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, like I said, fifteen. This is number sixteen. The next one's number sixteen, which is uh this is the one of the last movies. The next one's the last movie, but here it is. This is a movie called The Phenomenal Movie. This is fantastic. John Wayne is playing Davy Crockett in this film. Crockett. And this film is called The Alamo. That's right, The Alamo. This is a fantastic artwork, by the way, in the front, nice poster. This is the Alamo, really good film. So this also stars Richard Meidmark, Lawrence Harvey, and Richard Boone. So another Western looks good. So John Wayne there. And here is the back, where you can see John Wayne as Davy Crockett. Fantastic. And here is the DVD. So yeah, that was the Alamo. This looks fantastic, and this one came out in 1960. So this is a 1960. Here you get a you get the theatrical trailer in this, and the documentary in this. So th that's good. That's another MGM title, The Alamo. Very fantastic. So there we go. That's all my titles here, and we got one more one to start off with, which is. That's right. This is the next one. This is the next one. I put in 
number there. There we go. The Cowboys, which is the 17th, I believe, movie in my collection right now. So here is, this is a film by Warner Brothers on Blu-ray. So some films got on DVD and some of them are got on Blu-ray. I don't really matter which format. I just found this in CX and picked it up. So here is the back. And it does look phenomenal, by the way, this film, The Cowboys. It looks great. So here's the back with all the characters there in, in the back. This is 1971. The Blu-ray's there. So yeah, the Blu-ray is fine there. You got so many special features if you want to take a look at the back. You've got the trailer and everything. So that's pretty cool. That was the last one. There we go. There we have it. That was all my titles here of John Wayne. All my titles here. Now we're going to go for our box sets. Really interesting. I love these titles. Really awesome titles. And let's check out the John Wayne box sets. Great titles. So which box set? Which box sets are we going to go for? We're going to go for first. So we have this big box set here distributed by One Republic and Universal Pictures. And we have this another box set by John. It's a John Wayne collection, obviously. This is a Paramount John Wayne gift set, a DVD set, which has about so many films in it. I will tell you how many movies there. But there we go. Which one shall I choose? So, the Paramount or Universal? Uh, well, the first... The, the Universal set starts with the 1930s movies. And this set here starts off with the 1950s movies. So, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? I'll tell you what, I'll save the best for last. No, I'm kidding. I'll save the, the greatest for last. And I'll, and I'll do my Paramount John Wayne DVD box set. And then we'll take a look at this John Wayne set because this is a big edition. This is a big box set, and this is you know it's more to get better to get through. So let's take a look. So here we have it. This is the Paramount John Wayne, the John Wayne Paramount collection. Now they do have a trailer for this collection as well on YouTube, so you can see the trailer as well for this collection. So here, this set is a box set, it's a gift set, and this set here, this set here has fourteen movies. So I'm going to check it out see what they have in there. So here is the spine. You get a picture of John uh, Wayne as True Grit there. Fantastic. Really awesome. So really lovely spine there. We like the spine. And here is the back. Now I've got to say I did pre-order this on eBay. And here is the movies here. And you get some special features. I love the background for this. Look, Desert Eye, like a... Desert Rocks there. Really awesome. I love the presentation of this box out here. I love it. It's really, really good. So there it is. Really awesome. And then there's all the posters for the movies. Same artwork here as well. So all the films here. Yeah, fantastic DVD set. And here is the top. Yep, so you get the same thing here. All the movies, 14 movies. At the bottom, you get the synopsis and all the stuff there. So this set was released, obviously distributed by Paramount Pictures, but it was also distributed also by Batjack as well, Batjack Productions as well, so, yeah. So the easy way to open this set is by just sliding it, you know, I'm going to move this because it's very distracting. There we go. So how you open the set is just, there's a thing here, like a, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a line here. You just put it out like that. There we go, and it opens up like this, and it's very comes with a very nice case. And as soon as I opened this set inside, you do get True Grit there again, <laughs> inside there in the set. Phenomenal set, I love it by Paramount. Paramount did a great job with the set. Very protected discs. They need to be protected discs because I don't want any of them scratched. There's a fantastic picture there, uh, all the way around there when you open this set here. Good morning. So, phenomenal, phenomenal box. I love it by Paramount. So, let's take a look. So, the set comes in this, like, booklet box thing. So, I will show it down here. So, this is what the set looks like. Exactly the same. Phenomenal. And guess what? It's not broken on the top here. So, that's what makes me love this thing even more. That His hat is still intact on this set, though. You do get a few marks there so one here and one on the top there which is very unfortunate i know you didn't notice that but you didn't notice that but yeah shame but it doesn't matter it is what it is 
So here is this front, and all the discs are stored in here. Oh, let's, take a look. let's go through these movies. In this fantastic box set, 14 movies. So as I open it, so you get a picture of also True Grit again. With nice interior artwork, so you got all the mountains there on the background. So here is scenes, uh, I mean, cast of the film and the dates. So you can obviously see the dates and all the cast of the movies here on the side. And also on the back, I forgot to mention, it has the same thing. You get all the cast members here of all the movies. So you got all the cast there. So really cool. So let's just take a look at the front. Here's the front. So the first movie we get is Island in the Sky, 1953. 53. The next movie you get is Hondu. Oh, and this movie came out in 1966, I believe. 1953 again. No, 1953. Oh, this is Region 2, by the way. Region 2 set. So this is another collector's DVD. This is The High and Mighty, which came out in 1954. That's right. Next one. And this time we have artwork as well, because usually grey discs, but I don't care because that's really cool. So the next one we have is a 1962 movie with James Stewart, which is a man who shot Liberty Valance. Phenomenal movie. Fantastic. Very popular. Very good film. It's a very good film. Here is Atari here on DVD, 1961. Looks a very good film. The next one we have Donovan's Reef here on DVD, 1963. The next one is McClintock. See, this is the better edition to McClintock here on DVD. This is, looks really good on DVD. Uh, this is on my last video that um that I did a uh, a DVD uh, review on McClintock, my, my other DVD um that I had on this on the part one, I think it was. And yeah, that's McClintock there. Better edition, better edition, looks better. And that's 1963 as well. So the next one is 1965 with Kirk Douglas there. That's right, Kirk Douglas. With John Wayne in the movie In Harm's Way there. So phenomenal film. Looks great. And it is great. It's a great film. And this is The Sons of Katie Elder. Another film which stars Dean Martin and John Wayne. 1965. All of these DVDs are fresh. Brand new. Well, some of them. Uh, two of them are scratched, I think. El Dorado, 1966. With Robert Mitchum there. And John Wayne. So fantastic cast. The next one is True Git. True Git. <laughs> True Grit. There we go, that was 1969. Uh, fantastic film. The remake is okay, but nothing can beat the original. There we go, this is Real Labo, 1970. Fantastic film. Uh, Big Jake, 1971 film. All on DVD. And this is just all these, some of these DVDs are actually by CBS DVD, so they have this box set as well. And the last film, and this is a phenomenal film because this is actually the last film John Wayne ever did before his passing. In 1970, I think it was 1978, I believe. And this was The Shootist, a phenomenal film. A great, great, great film. And I think it was 1979 he passed away. Yeah, 1979. Fantastic film. This is one of his last film. James Stewart is also in this, with him is in this film as well. So, and this also stars a very young Ron Howard as well. So yeah, phenomenal film. You get like background artwork as well. The disc is okay. It's not scratched. It's a bit of a... Yeah, it's all right. It doesn't got scratches. Just scratches. But there's interior artwork there, so you get interior artwork from here to there. There we go. So that is the last film, the legendary, the shootest, the last film he ever made. John Wayne, the shootest, 1976. Now what I should have done is unboxed. Uh, that collection then unbox this one because this contains his last movie in this box set so so there we go uh the paramount pictures box set of john wayne this also featured one of his last movies in this box set as well so this is why i picked it up uh yeah that that is john wayne's paramount collection now let's take a look at the last this one is a big big box set this contains 34 films in this dvd box set now this box set is a box set that was distributed by universal pictures and one republic studios i think it was one republic let's check have a look at this uh no just republic studios not one republic just republic 
This is a Region 2 DVD box set. This is also a Region 2, 4 and 5. Uh, yeah, box set as well. Uh, what am I going to say to this? Let's just take a look at this phenomenal box set. Here, this is the John Wayne 34 movie collection. Let's take a look. And this is number... Oh, you know, that the, the, you know the, the side. Anyway, let's take a look. So here is the front. This is a phenomenal... But look at all the pictures from John Wayne here in this box set. This is a phenomenal box set. This box set's come selling on for £74. Do you believe it? Do you believe it's £74? That is insane. So here is the box I will show off now. Here as well. So I'm holding, holding it as well. John Wayne. Nice. This box set is rated PG. Quiet Man. Great film. Legendary. And here is all the films here. On the side, so you can see the scenes from the film. Here is really cool. Uh, here is the front again, so you get the same artwork. So here's more movies on the side here as well. So you've got more scenes with the other side as well. Here is the bottom of the box set. Here's all the movies that you get, all 34 films. So yeah, box set distributed by Universal Pictures and Republic Studios. Now, how you open this set is very simple. You take this off. And voila. There we go. Let's just put that thing away. And here we go. Here is all the movies. So you get 34 movies here in this box set. So there's all the movies in this box set here. All distributed by Universal Pictures. So let's take a look. Starting with the first one. I was going to show you on the uh, floor, but, uh, you know, it will take a long time. So here it is. Here is the box out here with all the movies. <sighs> Lovely. Right, let's take a look. So there's 34 movies. Let's take a look. So the first one is Stagecoach. This film is a phenomenal film. This film started John Wayne's career. It boosted his career, made him more more into classic great films. This is a film, I don't even need to look at the year in this film, but it did come out in 1939. A very old film, black and white. It stars Claire Trevor as well. So it's a fantastic film. Claire Trevor is not the first time um, Clint e uh, John Wayne, not Clint Eastwood, has been in a film with Claire Trevor. So here is the back, stunning artwork. Really good. This is the last time I'll show you this, and there's the DVD there. So that's pretty cool. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put all the films on the table so you can see what is in this collection. I've already showed you Stagecoach, so we're going to show you the rest of them uh, the way you're in order here. Right, so the first one is Already Uprising, aka the first Rebel stars Claire Trevor and John Wayne. Here's the bank and give that a good pause. You can just read out what's in there. That's right, I'll gain that rising in 1939. Bless it. There's the disc there. And here we are with 1940s Dark Command on DVD there. Really nice artwork on the back. Give that a good pause, you can read it. And there is the disc there. This film here is a triple feature, and this contains Three Faces West and The Shepherd of the Heels, two great classic movies. Here is the back, you get images of the films here as well. You can pause that if you want to, give that a good pause. If I leave this all day, this video is going to take forever. If you open it, here is the DVDs there, DVD there, double feature DVD. There's a 1940 movie called Seven Sinners there with John Wayne and that actor that worked with John Wayne two times, I'm sure of it. Marlene Dirich, can't the name. Anyway, good actor, and here's the back, so you can pause it. And there is the disc there.
double feature. Lady from Louisiana, Flame of the Barbary Coast. And back, 1941, 1945. Double feature there. Disc. All clean there. And here is Lady for the Night. John Wayne 1942 movie. This is very good. Uh, I think that's Claire Trevor with um, John Wayne. I don't know. Let's have a look. No, no, it's Joan Blondell. Look at that pause. And there is the DVD there. And here is Reap the Wild Wind, a very different role for John Wayne. Like a, say, like a mystery action looks like movie. And this is a 1942 film. Here is the disc. And here is the spoilers, another movie that stars the actor Marilyn Durich. With John Wayne, the spoilers, a 1942 movie again. Not 1942 movies. There's the back, and here is the disc. If I can get it, there we go. There's the disc there. So it looks familiar, but it looks a, bit, a tiny bit different with the colours and that. So there we go. And here is another double feature, which is War of the Wild Cats and In Old California. Double feature. There's the back, and give that a good pause to read. And here we go. No California and War of the Wildcats. Give it a good pause and read. And here is the DVD. Oh my god, look at this one. Really awesome artwork. It's fire tigers. Flying tigers. Where's the back? You can pause it for a little bit. Double feature, Dakota and Pittsburgh there. Nineteen forty two, nineteen forty five. The next movie is a movie called The Fighting Sebus, nineteen forty four, starring John Wayne and Susan Haywood. So really awesome film here. And here is the disc there. The next movie is a film called Tall in the Saddle, another 1944 film. So yeah, really awesome, really awesome artwork on the back there, really nice photograph. And here is the DVD here, uh, really nice DVD, really awesome, it's from Rainbow West, really cool. Back to Bhutan, a 1945 film, and here is the back here. This stars also Anthony Quinn. And there is the DVD here. This is Angel and the Badman. This is the one I've been talking to you about. So the, on the last video I did was talking about this. But in like a bad edition, you know, pixelated. But this is a proper DVD release of Angel and the Badman here. And I've got it in this Universal box set. It's a fantastic film, Angel and the Badman. If you've never seen it, I recommend you watching it if you've never seen it. It stars Gail Russell as well, Angel and the Badman. Here is the back of this. This is a phenomenal film, it's really good. If I open it, the disc should be in here. That's right, disc, Angel and the Batman. Fantastic. This one is just Tycoon. After Angel and the Batman DVD. Fought a pig. Can we find her as well?
This is a phenomenal film. This is The Flying Kentuckian. This also stars, as well as John Wayne, we got Oliver Hardy. That's why Stan Lauren Oliver Hardy, Oliver Hardy appears in this film. Fantastic film. The next film is a film called True Glory Yellow Women, a 1949 film. It got released soon in 1950. So a really awesome film here. Um, John Wayne, you know, at his best in this film. It's a great film. Uh, really good. There's the DVD there for True Glory Yellow Women. Awesome. And the next one is a film called Rio Grenette Grenade, starring John Wayne and Maureen O'Hara. A great film, and here is the disc. Sands of Iwo Jemima. This film is a 1949 film. Really good film, and here is the disc there for that film. The next film is the classic John Ford film, John Wayne classic, Quiet Man. The Quiet Man. Love this film, this also stars Marina O'Hara. A lovely film, really classic by John Wayne. Really good film. Uh, there's the disc there. Great film. Quiet Man, 1952. And here is The Flying Leathernecks, starring John Wayne and Robert Wyan here. This is a 19, 1951 film. Here we go, The Flying Leathernecks, DVD there saying John Wayne at war. Really cool there. There's the disc. And here is the next film, which is The Conqueror. A very underrated John Wayne movie, and I'm not going to say who he plays, but there's John Wayne as his character there in the film. Uh, yeah, The Conqueror, a very good film, very underrated, but I can... I know. There's the DVD, anyway. Uh, yeah. So here is the next film, which is Jet Pilot. This film I mentioned before, this has a Blu-ray release coming soon, and... This is the DVD version, this is John Wayne and Janet Leigh in the movie Jet Pilot. It's a really good film, uh, John Ford. Uh, but yeah, this film is a 1957 film. Really awesome. The War Wagon, 1967 film which stars Kirk Douglas. This ain't the first time Kirk Douglas has actually been in a movie with John Wayne, believe it or not. That's right. Uh, there is the, this is the War Wagon, this is one of his films that he did with John Wayne. The War Wagon. He made three together in total. I think it's four, three. There's the DVD there. The War Wagon. Great film with John Wayne and Kirk Lewis. The next movie is actually based on a true person. This film is called Hellfighters. A 1968 movie. I'm really digging into the 70s now, but this is a really good film from 1968. Great film. Uh, Hellfighters there. Also stars Catherine Ross and Jim Hudson. And the last film in this box set, Rooster Cogborn, starring John Wayne and Catherine Hepburn. Yeah, very good film, very awesome film. This is actually the second film in the True Grit franchise. True Grit, this is the second film that tells all about Rooster Cogborn. And yeah, fantastic film. And there's the disc there, so it's very different compared to the other discs sin already. So there we go. Last film there. Rooster Cogborn. A 1975 film. So that was everyone. That was it. That was my John Wayne Universal Pictures Complete 34 DVD Film Collection. That was my last collection in this set. If you're a big fan of John Wayne and you like the 20, 20 sec, the 22nd of July, Cowboy Day, hope you enjoy it. hope you have a good time. And thank you for watching this John Wayne collection with me. And hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, always comment, share, like, subscribe. That's right. Always helps the channel. Grab the notification bell. Or, you know, you know those things. And... I really hope you enjoyed this video. I really was dying to do this collection. And thank you for watching. Uh, this is Luke Davis from Film Luke's Film Boxings saying see you later and thanks for watching this sort of video. And I'll see you in the next one. If you're a John Wayne fan, you'll definitely love this video. This unboxing. So I'll see you later. I hope you enjoy the video. Uh,
I'll see you for now.